I'm Dr. Chris Blevins with Equine Field Service here at Kansas State University Veterinary Health Center. And we're gonna go through a little bit about what we do here uh, in field service with our fourth year veterinary students, which I have behind me here, uh, getting ready to do a physical exam. This is a day-to-day -day, um, examples of what we do. Uh, students do uh, the physical exams and treatments and diagnostics uh, as we move forward with cases. Uh, and really, as we uh, see these cases, the students learn uh, one, even handling, interaction with that of the, of the horses, and some aren't even horse interested or horse uh, people, and they become more comfortable as they're on for uh, field service. We do general practice uh, things out on the farm, but we also do it here in the hospital as far as general uh, procedures, even vaccines, Coggins, those kind of things for horses. So we're gonna work our way through doing a physical exam and then doing a dental exam on a horse today here for equine field service at Kansas State University Veterinary Health Center. So then I'll just double check to make sure everything is okay um, with our patient. All these patients, when we see them out in the field, uh, have a clinician attached to them too. So it's not just the students, but also they get multiple eyes and ears and everything based on the physical exam with the student, then also the clinician. So I'm gonna just double check, see if I see anything abnormal uh, with the horse of the physical exam, listen to the heart and lungs, and then we'll uh, proceed forward with, uh, with sedation for a dental exam. So the students get really good at uh, skills, IV injections, those kind of things as they're on for field service too. Uh, I am intramuscular vaccines and all kinds of other shots too. So, uh, and then I always am watching to make sure and giving them feedback. Obviously we're always trying to keep our patients safe so I'm always just there to, to kind of make sure everything goes, goes well, but uh, there for them if needed here as we, we move forward. Good job. And this is uh, these students' second week already on the rotation, so I don't even really have to tell them kind of how to get things set up. They already know the routine, how things get set up through here. Veterinary assistant that's usually with us too as we um, kind of come together and, and go. Uh, and then, uh, We'll go ahead, one of them is gonna assign the, the student doctor on the case, so they'll go ahead and rinse out the mouth. They did the physical exam, uh, and then we'll, we'll do the dental exam here too. So we'll get everything set up for that. So we try to be efficient and using teamwork as the efficiency. So every student kind of knows a job and kind of moves ourselves through a, a case. So we're not having to, one, waste time for the client, or have to give excessive amount of sedation for our patients. Just like we're doing the exam, I let the students do just as much of the exam as I do so they get that interaction, we get feedback, we talk about what we find, uh, and so they're ready or feel confident in them whenever they graduate in May to, uh, to do these type of services and skills for clients when they're done. But this is a dental endoscope. Again, we're looking in all areas of the mouth it's great for the student in learning, but also great for clients because they can actually watch what we're doing too. They'll usually be in here for the exam 